وَقَالَ عَزَّ وَجَلْ Brother, this is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying huh? in the Quran, Surah Hujrat, ayat number 12. إِنَّ بَعْدَ الزَّنِّ It's moon. Huh? That some of your guessing is a sin. You got the idea? People always assume something about somebody, brother. That assumption can be a sin because you are sometimes saying some things which are not correct. It can amount to lying things about somebody. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? So we have two examples. Uh, one is from the sayings of Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam that how iyaka, iyakum, iyaki can be used. Ajib anil asilati lahatiyati for you to do it. Will you be able to make an attempt and do it? Or have you done it? Inshallah you will do it. Huh? What shall I say? You must do it. You must do it. Huh? If you, whenever you find time, and if you haven't done any of the previous one, when you read the lesson, you should try it. Huh? What will happen? It will make you strong. It will make you strong, inshallah. <clears throat> now we come to the <clears throat> important discussion about fiel lazim and fiel mutaddi. <clears throat> Yan kasimu. What is this verb, brother? Yan kasimu. Form. Form seven. What is maadi? In kasama. Huh? Form seven. Huh? To divide, to split, huh? to separate, to partition. The fear is divided. Huh? There is the file of Yan Kasimu Al Fialu. That is your file. Be huh? Tibari, what is now brother this? Yetibar. Form eight. Form eight, huh? Yatabara <clears throat> Yatabiru to consider, to regard. So what is the meaning of this sentence? Yan Kasimul Fialu bi Atibari Maanahu Ila Mutaddin Walazim. The fial is divided according to its meaning. Are you with me? With regards to its meaning. Huh? Either it is lazim or it is mutaddi. Huh? Either it is transitive or it is intransitive. According to its meaning, the fail is divided into these two groups. Okay. Fal mutaddi. Mutaddi. Brother, look at the verb. Huh? Look at the verb. What is it? Mutaddi. Mutaddi. Form? Form 5. Form 5. And what is Mutaddi? Ism 5. Now, this also we must understand, brother. See, I feel like going deeper into the verbs. Huh? I enjoy going deeper into the verb. And it gives you then <coughs> deeper meaning, brother. Okay? Adda. What is Adda? Huh? To transform. Okay? Make it into five form from Adda. The Adda. Huh? Adda, form two. Make it into form five. How will you make it? The Adda. What is the meaning of the Adda? To be transitive. To, to be transitive. To become transitive. The Adda, what will be the Mudarya? Yata Adda. Huh? Yata Adda. Remember Form 5? Everything Fata Fata Fata. Make it now a some file. Huh? Muta 
at then. Eh? Only in form 5 and five, form 6, you give a kasra when you make it into ism, fine. Otherwise, there are no kasras there. So mutaaddin, or if you put alif lam, muta addi. Are you with me? Muta addi. Huh? Okay. So when you say al muta addi means transitive. It is transitive. Now it is the explanation of the, what is the transitive word. What is ma here? al -lazi. Uh, It's not ma nafi. But it is ma al Are you with me? You write it down. Right? But otherwise, you may get confused. Fal muta'addi. So muta'addi. al Tajawaza. What kind of a verb is this? Form 6. Form 6. Huh? Tajawaza. Form 6. What is the meaning of tajawaza? To extend beyond. Huh? To pass beyond. But write down extend beyond. Got the idea? Tajawaza is form 6. To extend beyond. Hadathuhu. Huh? What is the meaning of hadathu? Effect. Huh? Effect. Huh? Not defect. Huh? Effect. Asar we say, you know. So the, the transitive verb is the one whose effect extends beyond the file. And it goes to the mafulun bihi. You understand, inshallah? Okay. See, the file is mafulun bihi here. In this particular case, because hadathu is your file. Huh? The effect of it extends beyond the file to mafulun bihi. Means the effect of it extends beyond the subject. And it goes to the object. Fine. That's it, brother. And I say in my very simple explanation, brothers and sisters, that whenever there is a verb, file is there. But sometimes the action, which is the verb, and the file is the doer of the action. Huh? And then the action is received by somebody. Are you with me? There is a doer of action and... Receiver of action. Now this is uh, my very simple way of, sometimes I explain like this, you know. But if it helps you, alhamdulillah, you know. So, I ate an apple. So what is the action? Eating. eating. Who is the doer of action? I. I. Who received the action of eating? Apple. apple. Got the idea? Inshallah. Very good, huh? Bana Ibrahimu. Brother, alayhi salam, put it in the bracket because this is a parenthetical sentence, you know. Al Kaabata. So the action of building, uh, Bana is to build. Uh, who was the doer of the action? Ibrahim. And who received the action? Kaaba. Or you can say the effect of Bana extended beyond the file and went into. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Wahua yahtaju ila fa'il. Ya fa'aluhu. It needs a file. The action needs the file to do the action. Wafulun bihi yaka'u alayhi. What is yaka'u? What is the verb in the Mahdi? Waka'a. Waka'a means to fall. And waka'a also means to happen. In this case, it will be happen. Huh? That it happens on it. Which is mafulun bihi. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. 
Wa alamatuhu and the, what is the sign of it? An yakbala, it accepts. Ha'a, remember? Ha'a damiri, the pronoun ha. Okay? Allati ta'udu ila mafulun bihi, which then returns to the mafulun bihi. Now this sentence, brothers and sisters, wa alamatuhu an yak. Bala ha damiri allati taudu ala mafulun bihi is explained in this way, brother. Karaat talibud darsa. Kara, he read, read what? Darsa, fine. Wa fahimahu. Now you see, fahima accepted the damir. Who? Where does it return to? It returns to darsa, which is mafulun bihi. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So Fahima got a Damir Ha attached to it. It accepted it. And that who returned to the Mafulun Bihi Darsa. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Ra'aytu Hasharatan Thama. I, I saw a poisonous insect. Okay, brothers and sisters? And what did I do? Hasharatan is insect. Bagh. What did I do? Fa kataltu ha. Where does this ha return to? Hasharatan. Huh? Are you with me, brother and sister? Which was mafulun bihi. That is another sign of a fail being mutaaddi, transitive. That it will accept uh, the damir ha. But then you cannot have jalasa with damir ha. Or, or Zahaba, because those are intransitive. Okay, next one, brother and sister. Wallazimu, an intransitive. Mala. Huh? What is ma again here? Allazi. Allazi. Mala yata'adda asruhu fa'ilahu. The asar of it. Now, before it was hadathu, now it is asaruhu. Huh? It does not extend beyond the file. That's all. I told you, brother, the adda to extend beyond. Huh? So the asar of it, uh, the effect of it, does not extend beyond the file. Kharajatullabu. Huh? Hmm? Students went fine, brother. The fiel and file are happy. They can live happily ever after. <laughs> okay. Well, Farihal Mudarisu, the teacher became happy, good. The, when the teacher becomes happy, everybody is happy in the class. La yahtajul fialu, the fial does not need al fialu lazimu, this is your nath. Ila mafulun bihi. Brother, I forgot to ask you, yahtaju, what is the verb? Huh? Form 8. Ihtaja. Yahtaju. Ihtaja. Yahtaju. In this particular verb, the conjugation is a little tricky, brother. Ih. Ta. This is your maadi. What is your maadi? Maadi is ihtaja. And what will be the mudarya? Yah. Ta. Ju. You have to understand this. Eh? In this form 8, this kind of a verb, and we will come across several of them. Ihtaja, yahtaju. Ikhtara, remember? Ah. If you remember, ikhtara, what will be mudarya? Yahtaru. Yahtaru. Eh? Okay. Ihtaj. Ihtaj. And a very common word in Urdu, Mahtaj, is from this. Okay. Okay, well, brothers and sisters? Necessary. Now remember, Ihtaj will always have harf chair after it. And what will be that harf char? 
Ela, write it down, brother. Ihtaj will always, always have a half chair. Okay? Ela. Hmm? Says the Sumayya. You, whenever you will use the verb ihtaj, you will have to use the ela after it. Huh? Okay? Does it come in this sentence? La yahtajul fi'alul lazimu ela. Al maful bihi. Very good. Now, this is the most important thing that you will have to understand, inshallah, and highlight it. Huh? Very important thing that we are understanding now. Huh? Highlight it. Huh? What is it, brother? Kad yata'adda Kal yata'adda al-fi'lu lazimu The intransitive verb uh, becomes Kad means, brother, maybe. Huh? See, Kad has come up before fi'l mudariya. When the Qad comes before Fayal Mudariya, then it is not Harfu Tahkik. When Shayad, when Qad comes after Fayal Madi, Sister Mayuna, then it is Harfu Tahkik, certainty. When it comes, Qad comes before Mudariya, then it is maybe. Huh? Maybe. It means sometimes. Okay? The fail, which is intransitive, the fail, which is intransitive, can become transitive. Be vasitati. What is the meaning of vasitati? Vasitatun means means, by means of. Are you with me? By means of hafchar. So this is what you will highlight and try to understand, brother. By means of harf char. Now look at this example, brother. What is the example? First example, Gadibal Mudarisu. What is the translation? The teacher became angry. He must have got angry on somebody. Huh? So Allah has to come. Gadaba Allah. Are you with me? Alad Talibil Kaslani. So brother, is Gadiba transitive or intransitive? Transitive. Bivasitati Hafchar. Huh? Are you with me, Sister Madina? Next example, brother. Now Zahabtu Ilal Mustashfa. I went to the Mustashfa. Now if you use Zahabtu with Hafjar B, then the meaning changes. That you took someone to the hospital. Are you with me? So here is Zahabtu bil Marid. Means you took a patient to the hospital. Now here Zahaba became transitive. Bivasitati harfjar. Brothers and sisters, Ela is also harfjar. But then Ela does not make Zahaba transitive. But only B will make it transitive. Fine, brother. Thank you, sir. Nazartu. I looked. Looked at what? Elal Javali. So, brother, is it transitive? Yes. How did it become transitive? Bivasidati Harsha. See, when you say I looked, the meaning is not complete. Where did you look? What did you look? Then you have to say Ela. Very good. Now, this is a beautiful hadith. Kala sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Wa man raghiba an sunnati. I have explained to you, brother. Raghiba fi means you like something. Raghiba an means you dislike something. Huh? So, what is the meaning of this? Okay, this is Jumla Shartiya, brother. Huh? What is man? Ismu shart tajzimu fi alayhi. Where is the fi alu shart? Ragiba, Fialun Madin, Mabnun ala Fata, Fi Mahali Jasmin, Fialu Shat. Very good, brothers and sisters. An Sunnati. So, whosoever dislikes my ways, huh? okay, 
Unsunnati. How many words are there? An is harf chair. Sunnati is ism majrul. Wa huwa mudaf. And ya mutakalim mudaf ilayhi. Falaysa minni. Oh, brother, what is this? Falaysa minni. Okay, but how will you say alfa'u waqiyatun fi jawabishat? Fine. Laysa fi'alun madin jamidun. Jamid, okay. Where is the ismu laysa? Mustatil. Takdiru huwa. And what is minni? Jar majru. Shibu jumla. Khabar laysa. Now you will define it. What will you say? Al jumlatu fi aliyatu. في محل جزم جواب شر. الحمد لله. You got it, huh? إن شاء الله. We will keep on practicing, and even when we study Quran, we will practice it. And you will become, what shall I say? Experts. إن شاء الله. You will become experts إن شاء الله. فليس مني means he is not from me. يا متكلم. He is not from me. Uridu an attaliya ala manhaj. Madrasatika. What is the translation? I want to be acquainted or I want to know the curriculum of your school. Okay? So, ittala'a. What form is this? It is form 8. Alhamdulillah, you got it. Ittala'a is to get acquainted, to know, to become aware of it. So, here, brothers and sisters, always, always, ittala ala. I would ask you to even highlight half chap, or underline it, or put it into circle, to remind you that this half chap has to be used after the verb. Whenever you see a transitive verb uh, becoming or is, has become transitive, vivasitati half chair, you must make note of that half chair. Right? Inshallah. Okay. What's the next one, brothers and sisters? La arghabu. Raghiba yarghabu. Fee, to be interested, to like something. La aragabu fis safari. What does it mean? I don't like to travel. What is the meaning of it? I don't like traveling. Because la came. If you say aragabu fis safari means I like traveling. I like traveling. Haza lusbu. Haza is your. Zarf, naiban zarf, and what is usbu? Badal, after haza. Okay, it came after haza. So la argabu. I don't like because argabu is followed by fi, which which means I like. But when you put la, I don't like traveling this week. Or in English we'll say I don't like to travel this week. Well, you samma. What is you samma? Majhul. Samma you sammi. Now summiya you samma. You samma mafaulu mifli hadal fiel. Brother, what is mafaulu? Naifai. Wa huwa mudaf and misli mudafilihi. And wahua mudaf and haza mudafili. And what is fairly? Badal. Badal haza hakim. What is it called? Yusamma means it is called. What is it called? Gaira sarihin. What is badal sarihun? Explicit. Straightforward. And this is not explicit. Inexplicit. It is not straightforward. This mafulun bihi is not direct. What do you call it in English? Indirect mafulun bihi. What do you call it? Indirect mafulun bihi. Okay. Now look at it. 
This is the line you've got to highlight. This is the gist. This is the cream. Who are majrurun? Lafzan. Biharfi ja. Who are majrurun? Lafzan. What is the meaning of lafzan in pronunciation only? Biharfi ja. Mansubun. Mahlan. In its real places, Mansu. Allah huh? Annahu because Allah Annahu means because Mafulun Bihi Gairu Sarihin. Gairu Sarihin means indirect, not explicit, not straightforward. This line has to be highlighted, underlined, and understood well, inshallah. My is Specify. Mayyiz al-lazima min al-muta'addi fi mayali. In what follows. Huh? Specify. This is a very beautiful exercise. I want you to score 100% out of this. Huh? Okay. Sister Afsa. Yashrahu al-mudarrisu darsa. Marra time. First translation. The Mudaras explains the dars twice. Huh? Fine, brother and sister. Is, where is the verb? Yashrahu. Is it lazim or mutadi? Mutadi. Where is the mafulun bihi? Adarsa. Clear cut. Huh? Sister Abir. Dahikat tullabu. Translation Dahikat tullabu. What is tullabu? Students. File. Huh? Translation? The students laughed. What is it? Dahika tullabu, the students laughed. Is dahika transitive or intransitive? Lazim or mutadi? Lazim. Not transitive. Intransitive. Huh? It is intransitive. So what will you say in Arabic? Lazim. Huh? It does not need buffer. The students laughed. Fine. They laughed, you know. Okay, Sister Sukhaina, Raja Abi Al Bariha. It's Lazim. Raja is always Lazim. Sister Naima, Hafistu. Hafistu al Quran. Wa ana sagirun. Translation I memorized the Quran when I was young. Now, this is Vaul Hal. While I was young, this is Baul Hal and Jumla Halia. Fine. Af is tu. Where is the file? Tu. Is this verb lazim or mutaddi? Why? Do you have a mafulun bihi? Do you? Yes, we have a mafulun. Where is it? Al Quran. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Brother Hassan? Brother uh, Muhammad? Brother uh, Haider Ali, you got it, inshallah? Okay, fine, brother. Sister Sumaya, Ijli Suna. Lazim, this is Lazim. We know that it is. Jealousy is Lazim. Okay. Sister Aisha, Mutahaddi, huh? See, Fataha is Mutahaddi. Huh? Iftahil Baba. Okay, next one. Wa agrilikin nawafiza. Is it lazim mutadi? Mutadi, mashallah. See, now you can see it huh? and feel it. Huh? But form two and four, most of them, most of them will always be mutadi. Huh? Okay. Okay, Sister Maimuna. Amar Allahu Ta'ala Ibrahima. Mutahaddi, yeah? Amara is mutahaddi, very good. Alayhi salam bi zabhi ibnihi, Ismaila. What is Ismaila? Ji? Badal. What is it? Badal for ibni. Got the idea? Are you with me? Huh? Ismail here is the badal for ibni. Huh? Alayhi salam. Okay, Sister Nasrin, you got a very easy one. 
Nam Tiflu. It is last. Huh? Okay. Sister Mayanas, Kumtu Min Nawmi Mutaakhiran. So Kumtu Min. It's a mutaaddi. Bi wasitati harfchan. Mashaan. Nusrat. Very nice word. Nabudullah. Wana wala nushriku bihi shay'an. So what is nabudu? Mutaaddi. Nabudu. Where is the mafulun bihi? Allah. Allah. Very good. And nushriku. What form is this? Form four. Huh? Ashraka yushriku. So what is the meaning of it? We worship Allah and we do not associate with Him anything. Wala nushriku bihi shay'an. Another mafulun bihi. So both of them are mutaaddi. Sister Madina. Lam akul shay'an. Mutaaddi. Okay. Sister Rahima. Taib al ummalu, lazim. The workers became tired. Sister Gulshan, rahabtu biduyu. First, tell me the translation. Rahabtu, rahaba is to welcome. What is it? To welcome, to greet. So, I greeted. Greeted whom? Do you? So this is mutaaddi bivasitati harfichar. Got the idea? Okay. Bidduyuf, what will you say? Bidduyuf majroorun lafzan. Wa mansubun mahalan. Inshallah. You'll say like that. Very good. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Alhamdulillah. Next verb is important verb. What is the verb? Yasirul fialu. What is the madi? Sara. No brother, Sara, Yasiru. Sara is the sister of Kana. What is the meaning of Sara? To become. To become. Sara, Yasiru is the sister of Kana. Sara is to become. Very important verb, brother. Yasiru fialu lazim mutaddiyan. Important thing to highlight and underline. Yasirul fialul lazimu mutaaddiyan. Translation, brother. The fial lazim becomes mutaaddi. The intransitive verb becomes transitive. Okay, brother. Yasiru is fialun mudariun nakisun. Okay, where is the ism of yasiru? Al-fi'alu. And what is lazimu? Naat. Oh, where is the khabar of yasiru? Muta'addiyan. Do you see mansu? Muta'addiyan. Very good. Be naklihi. By shifting it. What is the meaning of nakal? To shift something. Or transform something. Or even transport. But we say shift. Okay. Ila babai. What is babai? Babai. Do you have? Huh? Okay. Where is the noon? Has it, why? Because it is coming as a mudaf. Huh? Remove everything. Huh? So will you say ila babaini? What will you say? Ila babaini. Now bring everything back. Then you have to drop the noon. Hmm? See? Ila harfchar. Huh? Babai, ism majroor, wa alamatu jarrihi, al-yaw, li-annahu, musanna, wa huwa mudaf, and af'al mudaf ilihi, and fa'ala, kama yattadihu min al-amsilati al-atiyati, as it is made very clear, huh? From the following example. Okay, brother. Kama yatta diho. What is this, brother? Form eight. Huh? Brother, now we got to make some rules, you know. 
Huh? You make a mistake? One dozen samosas. <laughs> okay? Yattadihu ittadaha. What is the root? Wadaha. Wadaha. MashaAllah. MashaAllah. Your answers delight me. Make me very happy. Alhamdulillah. May Allah bless you all and all of us, inshallah. May Allah bless us all with more knowledge, inshallah. See, now they say there are two sentences. In one sentence, you have a fiel sulasi mujarrat, which is intransitive, and in the other, it is transitive. Okay? One is lazim, and other becomes mutaaddi. And if the fiel sulasi is already mutaaddi, then it becomes double mutaaddi. Huh? Double transitive. Huh? Watch for it, brothers and sisters. Kharaja hamidun min al fasli. Now, this whole exercise is of extreme importance. Huh? And later on, there's another exercise in which you will be using or making your own sentences, one with lazim verb and changing the same into form two or four and making your sentence with transitive mutaddi verbs, inshallah. So, what is kharaja hamidun? This is jumla failure. But the verb is lazim. Huh? Hamidun is the file. Min al fasli. Now change that kharaja into form 4 and it becomes akharaja. Huh? Now, brother, this is in Quran, it comes all the time. Akharaja al mudarisu hamidan. Min al fasli. So hamidan became mafulun bihi. Huh? Nazal al jarihu min sayaratil isafi. What is isaf? Ambulance. Sayaratul isaf means ambulance. The wounded person got down from the ambulance. Are you with me, brother? Now he is too sick to get out, or he's too wounded. Huh? To get out by himself. So what happens? Anzalal mumarriduna. What is mumarriduna? Male nurses. Mumarridun. Mumarriduna. Male nurses. Anzalal mumarriduna. Al jariha. Are you with me? Anzalal mumarriduna al jariha. Min sayaratil is afi. Translation, brother? Nurses brought the wounded person down. Jalasat talibul jadidu amamal madarrisi. Translation, brother? The new students sat in front of the teacher. Are you with me? Brother Hassan, you translate the next one. Ajalasa. Ajlasal mudarrisu talib al jadida amamahu. The new student. Mashallah. The, the teacher made the new student sit in front of him. Got the idea, brother? So in the first form, jalasa is intransitive. Then ajlasa, it became transitive. Kharaja, intransitive. Akhraja, transitive. Nazala, intransitive. Anzala, transitive. Very good, brother. Now we are doing form two. Nazala, teflu, minataira. Translation, brother Muhammad, translate this, brother. The child got down from the airplane. Oh, yeah, you got it, brother. Now you translate the other one. Nazaltu tifla. No, I, Nazaltu, I brought down the child. Uh, are you with me? Nazaltu means I huh? <laughs> brought the child uh, down from the airplane. Very good, brother. Now, brother uh, Hyder Ali, 
Namal Maridu. What will you say? Namal Maridu. The sick person went to sleep. Went to sleep. Are you with me? Fine. Now, Navama. See, Nama became Navama. Navama Dawao Al Marida. The medicine put the, the sick person to sleep. Are you with me? Somebody made the, the sick person to go to sleep. So what was that? Navamad Dawao. The medicine put the sick person to sleep. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Huh? Another nice sentence. These are such beautiful sentences. I wish if you had time, you will even write them down on your own to practice it. Or to say it a few times. Naja. What is the meaning of Naja? What kind of verb is this? Nakis. What is the root of Naja? Najava. Eh? This, is, this is a Nakis al Wabi. Naja mudarya yanju. Da'a yada'u. Fine. What is the meaning of Naja? To escape. Huh? To escape or to become safe. Or to be safe. Huh? Okay, brother and sister. Rukkabu. What is Rukkabu? Passengers. This is plural. What is singular? Rakibun. Huh? Okay. Rukkabu. Sayarati. The passenger of the car became safe. Or they were safe. Huh? Which is the car? Allati in Kalabat, which overturned. Are you with me? The car which overturned, but the passengers were safe. Huh? They were secure, unharmed. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fine. Now you transport, transfer this verb into form two. Naja will become Najja. Give us Mudaria. No, Mudaria. Najja. Yunajji. Najja. Yunajji. Yunajja means somebody made somebody safe. Huh? Someone made somebody safe. Okay, fine. Najja, what will be Allah? Who? Fine. Huh? Najja Allah. Najjallahu. Allah made safe. Huh? Okay. Whom? Passenger. So see, Rukaba. Huh? Mafulun bihi. Rukaba sayarati. Allah saved the passengers of the car which overturned. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Okay. So, in the first sentence, Naja was Lazim. And you brought it into form to Najja, Yunajji, it became Mutaaddi. Huh? Very important sentence to ponder over and think over, brothers and sisters, inshallah. Now, this is another nice thing. You got to highlight it, brothers and sisters. You got to highlight this. We will finish this and inshallah take a break, brothers and sisters. Is a Nukila. What is Nukila? Shift. shift huh? Transform. Shift. Transport. Huh? Is it Madi? It's, it's, it's Madi, but it's Majhul. Huh? Madi, but it's Majhul. Where is the knife file? Alfiail. Huh? Huh? So, Isa means brother, if, or when. Huh? Nukila means. There is another word for Nukila. Hawwala. What is it? Hawwala. Hawwala also means to change. Huh? Okay. So how will you say is a... Hawwila. Huh? What will you say? Hawwila. It is change. Huh? Just I want you to, you know... Okay. Hawwala. That you will huvila. Huh? What is the meaning of huvila? 
נוקילה. אריוז מי בן שש? נוקילה. 